everybody. Um, so today, hello everybody, I am Moneymaker here, and today we're going to play this demo called Sleeping Dogs. Um, um, we're going to get started, and this, uh, who cares about that? Now this, uh, this is kind of like, um, detailed the most, but it's kind of like a demo. So anyway, this is a demo. I don't know what to do. Well, I downloaded it, and my friends told me to download this game. So, hey you! Up. Are you shitting me? So what'd you do? Nothing, nothing. Say mut the mole. I came straight to you. I didn't want to start anything major without you knowing, you know? So get this. A couple years ago, this guy Mate came to me and asked me to look out for him while he did business. Special K mostly, but other stuff too. I thought, why not? I'll take a nice little cut for my boys, no problem. This week, I sent Jackie here to pick up the envelope and he tells my boy to fuck off. Apparently, he's friends with dog eyes now, so we can all go fuck ourselves. You want me to make an example out of dog eyes? That home god time is gonna get what's coming. Right now, I need someone to take care of.
San Francisco, alleged ties to organized crime, and now you're here, enforcing for the sun on ye. You know, you don't have to throw your life away. I, I, I understand. Your concern's really moving. Yeah, I appreciate that. I'm suddenly realizing I should have never dropped out of art school. I could have made it. I could have been a real somebody. Thank you for showing me the light, officer. I want to give you a chance, Shen, but you have to work with me. Then maybe I can cut you a deal. Oh, superintendent. I'm in the middle of an interrogation. Inspector, there's been a misunderstanding. Misunderstanding, sir? As your superior officer, I'm instructing you to release this man. But, sir, I have it on record that he's son on ye. I understand that. I can't simply just cut him loose. I mean, you're asking me to release a criminal with no connections to the triad. I and mean, not only is it against oh, for protocol... God's sake, Tang, he's one of us. What? Jesus, Pendrew, let me get the door. There are few badges outside who didn't hear you. It's all right, Way. We can trust her. Trust her? I just met her. Congratulations, Tang, so now you know. Maybe now we can make sure that we're helping Wei, not making his job harder than it already is, hmm? Yeah, it doesn't seem like I have much of a choice. No, no, you don't. Now see yourself out. Permission to speak freely. Denied. You need to be more careful, Wei. Much more careful. I can't bail you out like this again. Sir, I don't want to hear it. Just be careful. Okay, um, so what are we about to do is, I don't know what we're going to do about this. There's a complete, um, I'm not going to look like that. No, like, like, in the first beginning. Ew! Thank you, Sam. Hi-ya, ye-ya! What the fuck's going on? Dog eyes shut up, let's see what this restaurant tonight. Hot balan, do you say who they are? What's that I just heard? Your mother? She's... She's fine. But two of our people were killed. And a couple of customers were wounded. The police are there now. Wait, wait. He went after your family? That all? Everyone's outside. Water choice. You always should fight. Listen up! We're hitting his sweatshop on the waterfront. All his drugs moved to that place. It's how he makes his money. I want it burned to the ground. Siwa runs the operation. Put that punk guard's heart in the shadow grave! And don't turn my gear! It's all up! Winston, are you sure about this? Of I'm fucking sure! Look, what's the chairman gonna say when he finds his warehouse floating in the ocean? He's not gonna like it. But there's no way Dog Guys walks away from this. So burn the warehouse, but take Sua alive. Put him to work for you, and give the chairman a bigger cut than he was getting from Dog Guys. Okay. Okay, okay, do it. Bring him alive. Right, boss.